Hello folks, so here's a quick upload for you. Uh, so I'm checking for this particular code, 3649. That's the inlet knock sensor. The first one downstream after the toggle. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna go into a data monitor. We're gonna start the engine and monitor the sensor. Right. I think um, the sensor the sensor start reading for the inlet I think it's over 250 degrees see it's 300 degrees and you monitor the inlet knock sensor you don't monitor the ppm reading the PPM reading is gonna, you know, that's I think maybe about 250 300 PPM right now. It have to activate, you can start activating it with you. Okay, so now we have some movements, you're gonna see it fluctuating up and down. Initially, when it starts, it starts like that, but after. Maybe after a few seconds to a minute, it should uh, level off. See, this one is not doing that. It's gonna go up and down, up and down, up and down. So that's the sign of a bad inlet knock sensor. So we're gonna swap it out and then we're gonna do uh, the test again and see how it's functioning. Here's the tool I use to take out the the knock sensor. It's a 22 millimeter or 70. This works pretty well. They have a long one too for different areas that you work. It's like an O2 sensor similar. So we have the old sensor out. This one that goes to the back of the top. Okay, so we swapped out the knock sensor. And this is the reading now. You see the temperature? It's 300 degrees. This started reading at 240 degrees. That's the inlet. The outlet have to get to, I think it's 450 degrees before it start, start to read. But you see it's, it's reading normal now and it's stable. Before it would not stabilize because the, the heater in the knock sensor was no good basically. Alright, so hopefully this helps someone who may have the issue and you know, if you have the comments inside, you, you know. You know how to verify that it's the knock sensor that's no good. These sensors are not cheap. It's like, I believe it's four, four to five hundred dollars for one. It's always good to verify before you change it. Alright guys, hope this helped. This is just a quick one.